answered. And how many sub-rubrics, sub-sub-rubrics are present in each rubric, that can't be technically answered. But what we can look forward is, uh, there are at least minimum four building blocks for a rubric. That is rubric, sub rubric, sub sub rubric, and sub sub rubric. How these uh, rubrics are constructed actually is like this there can be alternating sides or alternating states, and the sub rubric might constitute alternating states, and then sites, and then time modalities, and, or time as such, and then extensions, locations, the modalities as such, any phenomenon that is present. So you can choose what you want to see, what you don't want to see. If you remove this, it goes off. You won't see modalities. So this is how it works. So on default, you select everything. So how is it going to help you in selecting or choosing, um, uh, let us say, you want to see the extremities chapter. In that the minimum rubric size what you want is three so it has three things in it anger trifles and weakness it is related to extremities that is why it is seen here Not it. you go to the extremities it constitutes abscess hips left abscess thighs left so if extremities is the main section Abscess is the main rubric, this is the sub rubric, this is the sub sub rubric. And the number of memory listed in it is 1. You can see like that. If you see here, I have typed 3. Here there is one more find field wherein it shows hash and then 3 and extremities. So hash 3 is what it helps in. So all these rubrics that have come in the result are either constituting 3 building blocks or 3 uh, three components that is rubric, sub rubric, and a sub 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 rubric, and moreover, and whichever has more number than three can be seen. Similarly, in extremities, you can see up to five, I guess. So, these are five building blocks that is to say, ex in extremities is the section, pain is the rubric, cutting is the sub rubric, feet is the sub sub rubric, bones is sub 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 rubric left is sub 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 rubric so that is how it works so this is one and in extremities you want to see all those rubrics but you want to see only those remedies which are of fourth grade earlier i have shown here you can see I type this and then four so here you can see those remedies maximum gradation minimum grade is 4 here so you see all this so this symbol as we call in India star or originally in technical terms the ast asterisk so if you want to see like that you can see or you can search like that also you can click over here so here it is exactly what we actually wanted and we are changing to minimum one also so these are all the manipulations that this software actually allows you to give so when i type here extremities it shows wherever the word extremities is occurring that's why you can see in the mind section head stomach rectum and then to the extremities so if you want to specifically see only extremities you can type here extremities so only extremities will be shown here and this is to jump to field. This has other usages. Maybe I will not be able to explain it right now. I will be explaining later. Here is something called less. Uh, this is a filter for whatever remedies you want to see. If you want to see only those mineral remedies, you can see here. Only minerals are listed. If you want to see only no source, you can check over here. If you want to specify whatever you want to see, there are lots of things available here. If you want to see only the fungi, even in that, if you want to see only that of basidiomycetes, actually, this list is given. When you click over here. In each and every rubric, you will see only those remedies of basidiomycetes. 
in this it is not present that's why only the number is shown so this filter can be applied elsewhere in a different aspect So here we have come. You want to see only the remedies belonging to basidiomycetes. You can see here agaricus, clovista, the rest of the other known remedies is still ago. So if I change it to all, all will be coming. Similarly, all rubrics. You can see the different building blocks, whichever you want to see, it will be there. And that is the other thing. So this is how it works. And find section. It's very powerful. What are all the combinations that you use is going to help you in the way that you want to see. For example, if I want to see one particular remedy and all the rubrics that are present in that remedy, for example, pulse here, I, I type it and I, I type the remedy abbreviation. Now I can see all those remedy, rubrics that are covered by pulse till now. Yeah, I just want to compare it with that of Calicarp. So now it will show all those rubrics wherein either pulsatilla or calcarea carb, calicarb or both. So here first one alternating states it is present in both calicarb and pulsatilla. Whereas here if you can see morning and evening only calicarb is present, pulsatilla is not present. Here are some mind summer, pulsatilla only by the pulsatilla is present so this is some this is a comparison you can also go for the differential diagnosis which one but this is more to say for a particular rubric if you want to have a differential diagnosis it will be helpful in comparison if you want to see it can help you uh, but not exactly with this example maybe some other example you can have the comparison anyway by using this that's what i wanted to say and then next for example there is something common to this we'll see Andrew. so wandering is a red line symptom for both pulsatilla as well as Calicarb. If you see here, Calicarb talks wandering, wandering, pulsatilla is also there. It is actually more specific to pulsatilla, the wandering type. Even Calicarb has certain things that are wandering in nature. Now I remove this Calicarb, only pulsatilla is present. So you see here, wandering is present in mind, head, face, teeth abdomen, female section, chest, extremities, heart and circulation and so on. In general, this wanding is there. So that is how you can understand how wandering is a red line symptom of uh, pulsatilla. So that is for the study. If I now click this, I have used only one criteria, wandering. You can see wandering is foremost seen in pulsatilla. Next comes Calibicromicum. And then Calmia, Latifolia, Lac, Canilum, Colosin, Calophyllum, Calicelf and so on. So wandering is more, more, most reported in Pulsatilla. And it becomes one of the unique features of Pulsatilla. So this is for the study. We can study this way also. So th this software is, has lots of basic functionalities. It is as simple as it is. And it is complex as it is, as complex as it is. Everything that we need is here. How effectively we are going to use determines the result of it. We can have a piano in our hands. We may know to read the notes and play it. But how beautifully it is going to sound is depending upon the own tune that we make. And with our permutations and combinations, we can bring a soothing sound or a noisy one if we we ourselves have to compile a music similarly we can own a software but what we have to do is we have to practice it 
we have to understand it and then we can manipulate it in other words it is called as manipulation so this is you interacting with your computer or software everyone might be having your computer but it may not be appearing as my desktop this is the desktop of mine this desktop may not be resembling the same that of everyone it is how we make use of it or this uh, sidebar or whatever we say this is mine is like this but this same mac might be with someone else but he might be using in a different way the icons might be different depending upon the usage things may be so in the software also whatever we want to do is according to our own perception and our own requirements we have to interact with it for that we will have to what we have to do is basically go to the sorry we have to go to the site as actually or even in the software in itself we have a help section if you go to help section you have complete dynamics help so here everything is given how to get in how to get started everything is there the index module is there how does the index module work all things are there here you can go through it and then book module is there and then case analysis module is there how to add how to remove all these things are there the user manual must and should be read by each and every person it is downloadable at the site complete dynamic www.completedynamics.com and you can also have a overview here in the documentation section you have getting started section here you also have videos made for this you can see here different things how many languages are available in complete dynamics what is differential diagnosis that's the one that, that i wanted to explain you this is here you also have a video posted about it if you click over it you will have a video out of it which is in the youtube so you also have a pdf version of the user manual we have an ebook version also you can click over it and here it goes the link is already posted by me somewhere wherever where the question has been asked so these things has to be done what is remaining on our part is that we have everything the material is supplied but we should know how to use it and of course it is being assisted and i am happy being helping you but what is expected is we should also try to put forth our effort to learn or to know what actually is present in it and start doing it when you commit mistakes you can ask better question anyone and it is through practice that one gets perfect thank you all for listening patiently to me i hope so it was helpful i try to remember each and everything and i try to answer it maybe something might have been missing i apologize for it i apologize for the disturbances that might have come across and i am sorry for my english accent i can sound indian english or maybe tamilish english but anyway next time when i am posting i will try to add the subtitles to it thank you